Hey guys, what is up? It is me, Pagey, here once again with another video on the Flash Season 5. And this is, uh, like, obviously a bit of a different setup. I don't think I've done a Flash video like this since, I think, the Godspeed set photo thing. I think that was the last time I did a video like this in regards to the Flash. Obviously, I'm wearing my glasses because I need to read off a screen and... I sort of need to wear my glasses for it. I don't need them, but I sort of need them. But anyway, so massive stuff. Massive stuff in this episode. Um, I was sent a hint of this stuff happening, or at least um, me being told this information about... Uh, what day is it? It's... Uh, my, oh, no, I'm look, look, looking at my phone because it doesn't have the day on it for some reason. But anyway, I was sent it like a couple of days ago, and I was like unsure. I was unsure whether to believe it or not. I was like... Mm. Yeah, I'll, I'll, let it, I'll let it sit, I'll let it sit, and then when the information comes to me properly, I'll process it and see whether it's worth talking about. And man, it's pretty big. I actually I was expecting some decent stuff from where this information was coming from, but at the same time, I was like sort of hesitant on it, but I'm sort of happy that I've got it now because it's pretty big, and uh, it just shows you, I guess, the the levels, and I guess the uh, just the levels and the drive that the people behind the show are going for in regards to showing the, this character in particular we're going to be seeing in only like two weeks or something, but also characters going forward. So, obviously you can tell by the title, some pretty big stuff. So, first off, in regards to a bit later in this video, we're going to be looking at some new, uh, I guess, leaked Godspeed set photos, you know, just from when they were filming, uh, that have come out. Um, I don't know if these are specifically from episode 18 though. I need to make that sure. So these could be from episode 18, the actual Godspeed episode, or these could be from, uh, like episode 20 or 21. They're about to film the finale now for the Flash episode 22. These could be from like 20 or 21, but I would say they're from 18. I haven't been told specifically what episode they're from, but just keep that in mind that there's an unknown factor around those photos, but we'll jump into them after we get over or go through the, uh, I guess the main information for this video. So, as you can tell by the title, some Red Death and Godspeed stuff, and there's some leaked information, I guess you could say. Actually, there is leaked information, but also leaked casting info, and this is accurate, by the way. This is 100% legit, no joke. No joke at all. Okay, so Red Death, we'll just jump into it. Red Death, and okay, so just to give you some, uh, these guys, these two actors, it's they're both male characters, um, Red Death and Godspeed. Sorry if you can hear a car outside. It's decided someone's obviously wanted to go vroom vroom or something in the middle of the night. But these two actors were in the same movie like almost 20 years ago leading the movie. And you, I'll let you guys try and guess what the movie was and I'll reveal it later. But Red Death is going to be played none other than Ashton Kutcher. Um, obviously, he was like, you know, movie star. Uh, he was uh, the host of the MTV show Punked. Love punked. I love getting punked. I love when people get punked. Um, and then Godspeed will be played by his screen partner in a movie. And I've, and another, we've had um, Chris Klein in season five of The Flash who played Cicada or Orlan Dwyer. He was from American Pie. We have another uh, American Pie alum in the form of Sean William Scott playing at Godspeed, which is pretty crazy. And like, look, Red Death, they're going to change him up for the show. He's not going to be like he is in the comics in regards to who he actually is, if you know what I mean. But Godspeed, I was like, okay, who are they going to go for? Like, what angle are they going to go for? And then picking Sean William Scott is interesting. I don't hate the casting, but it's definitely interesting. But there is some casting description. So uh, we'll go over Red Death first, um, and then we'll go over Godspeed, because Godspeed's a bit more simple. Red Death's a bit out there. Um, so Red Death, the casting name he was given was Jack Off. Um, so Jack Hoff. Um, so Jack is in your normal name, and then uh, Hoff is in like Hasselhoff. Um, so H O W F is the last name. So Jack Hoff, uh, he's a male in his mid thirties, any race. So he could have been black, Latino, Asian, white, mixed, anything like that. But they've cast Ashton, Ashton Kutcher, guessing it's for the name recognition. So they can say, oh, Ashton Kutcher is playing Red Death or something. Anyway, so it could have been played by any race. There wasn't a specification on race there. Um, but this is the description of the character. Uh, Jack is a successful entrepreneur who has his past catch up to him in devastating circumstances. So, you know, successful entrepreneur, we don't really have to focus on that, I guess, unless he has like some sort of, you know, like tech company or something like that, or like social media thing or something that like plays into it or plays into something in the season. I don't know. I don't think that really matters too much. I think it's just really giving some backing to what he was doing before he was a villain. 
But then the main thing is who has his past catch up to him in devastating circumstance, uh, circumstances, might I say. So that's like the big thing. Like, what are these devastating circumstances? Are they, is it something directly involved with him? Like it's something that happens to him that's devastating? Or does he have a family? Does he have a wife, uh, some kids, you know, a son or a daughter or his parents or something are killed in some devastating circumstance? I guess that's the big question around there. And does that necessarily drive him completely to become Red Death, uh, or does it become Red Death solely because of that, or does maybe the circumstance that, you know, is devastating towards those other people affects him and that turns him into Red Death and sort of like corrupts him, corrupts him and then it goes about and does all this stuff. That's the big question. As I said, there's little to no information here. It's a really basic casting thing here, but yeah, so Jack Hoff um, is the cast now for Red Death. It might be him. As I said, Red, or Red Death I didn't say it in this video, but as you know, Red Death in the comics is like an amalgamation of Bruce Wayne and Barry Allen put together. And I don't think they were ever going to do that because we already had Savitar back in season three, like a weird version of Barry. I don't think they'd do that again. Um, so Jack Hoff might be his actual name. It'll be interesting to see, but um, yeah. And in regards to Godspeed, the casting name is actually August Hart. So Sean William Scott will be playing August Hart turn Godspeed or Godspeed with August Hart flashbacks, one of the two. This was a bit of a different one because as I said, the... Um, the Jack Hoff um, Red Death casting was a male in his mid-30s, so they wanted somewhere around that. I think Ashton Kutcher's older than that, but maybe he looks a bit younger. I don't know. Uh, but Godspeed, they were just looking for a male in his 20s to 40s. So there's a 20-year age gap, so I don't think they really minded. I don't think the age maybe is too relevant to what the character does, but they don't want someone like a, maybe like a 60-year-old playing Godspeed, you know? Uh, but the description for well, Godspeed or August is that, August is a chemical analyst with a checkered past and a struggle to regather thoughts from recent times. I don't really understand that too much. I can struggle to regather thoughts from recent times. I mean, does, does that mean he has like, he has like short-term memory loss or something? He might forget where something was and ask people where it is. I'm not too sure. Um, there might be like a whole, maybe that's part of the season, him trying to find where he left something. I'm not too sure. Yeah, he might have to go on a journey to try and find something. I'm not too sure. Maybe with a friend. I don't know. Maybe Godspeed's that, maybe our Red Death's that friend. Um, I don't know, but the chemical analyst is a bit different. Maybe they could tie him into CCPD still because he's, he's like a crime scene sort of person in the comics. So maybe he could be tied to CCPD or work there as a chemical analyst, or maybe he's just connected to CCPD. Like maybe the CSI people go to him sometimes for more, um, exact, you know, look-ins to certain things. Have to wait and see, but that's the Godspeed casting. It's going to be August Hard. He's a chemical, a chemical analyst. And yeah, but in regards to how they're going to be used... I'd like to think Godspeed and Red Death would be connected in some way. I don't think... I think it'd be sort of wasted if you didn't have them two together. I think it'd be pretty cool. Um, whether it be that they just team up eventually, or maybe Godspeed is the, the bringer of this devastating circumstance into Red Death's life. Maybe he's the one that brings about Red Death, or at least maybe corrupts him a decent amount. We did do a theory like a couple of weeks ago, maybe like, because Godspeed can clone himself, maybe that Godspeed clone could become Red Death. Um, but then that sort of looked the same, I guess. You wouldn't cast Ashton, Ashton, Ashton Kutcher as Red Death and then cast a different person as Godspeed. It wouldn't make sense there. So I'm guessing that they, if they want to make him connected, they might have to, one's the cause of the other, or they just maybe team up at a certain point to, you know, take on the Flash and Central City and stuff. I don't know. It's hard to tell. But the main thing and the big thing to talk about, and some of you guys might've already figured this out, but um, Ashton Kutcher and Sean William Scott, who are both playing Red Death and Godspeed, were actually both the lead actors or lead roles in Dude, Where's My Car? Like around 20 years ago. I think that movie came out in the year 2000. So by the time this season comes out, it'll be almost 20 years since that movie came out, which is pretty insane. So I doubt they would actually cast these two actors and then not use them together for a decent amount of the season. It would just seem weird. You know what I mean? Like... It's like having hot fudge and ice cream and just and then eating them separately. Like, are you are you are you simple? Like, why why are you putting them together? So, I, I don't know why they wouldn't put them together. I'm expecting them to put them together, but we don't know until they actually do it, or until we get next season and I guess later this season to see what they actually do with it. Okay, but now we're actually going to jump into these new Godspeed leaked set photos. I sort of wanted to wait until the end. So the people that actually did wait and wanted to see these set photos would get a special treat. So these actual set photos don't just contain Godspeed. They actually do also contain Red Death. So there's a bit of time travel here in the first one, which is, bit, I don't know necessarily the context to the scene, to be completely honest, but it is a shot of Barry and Star Lab. So these are like an actual shot from the show. So I'm pretty sure this is from like season two or season three. I think it's season two. I think, I think it might actually be the season two premiere. So this is Barry when he's in Star Labs alone, like everyone else has left and all that crap's happened at the end of season one. 
But then Red Death all of a sudden just shows up in this doorway here. And then all of a sudden Godspeed just peeks out. So it looks like this is going to be an onslaught from one side to the other. It looks like Red Death's going to attack him from one side. Godspeed's going to attack him from the other. And get Barry is all alone here. So I don't know how Barry's going to get out of this situation with two pretty deadly speedsters coming at him from both angles. Or from both sides. It's going to be crazy to see what happens here. But I'm looking forward to it. Should be a pretty cool scene. Now, the next leaked uh, photo is actually at Jitters on the outside. And you can actually see in the window on the left there, Godspeed is in Jitters. So he is, I don't know if he's killing people in there or he's just uh, relaxing. It's one of the two, obviously. But then the next photo, we can actually see Red Death on the right zoom in. So he's coming in. It's hard to tell whether he's running to Jitters as well. But you have to think if Godspeed's in there, that, um, that Red Death will be going in there as well. I don't know if it's a meetup, it's a plan, it's a date. I'm not too sure what's going on there, but... Uh, I don't know, leave your theories in the comment section down below in regards to what you think is happening there. The next one is a bit weird. I think this is when they're like they're having time off. This is actually Red Death and Godspeed at the beach. They're having a swim. Um, Self-explanatory. Um, Red Death's out a bit deeper or a bit further into the ocean, but it doesn't look too shallow or too deep, might I say. It looks like they can stand up, so it doesn't look like it's too bad. The weather looks nice, so I guess they're just having time off. Maybe... But they, maybe they did something to Barry and they don't have to really have to focus too much. But I guess this explains sometimes like villains aren't in like consecutive episodes. They might be gone for two or three episodes. This is what they're doing. They're having fun. And that continues on to the next set photo, which is actually Red Death and Godspeed on a roller coaster. So I don't know if this is a roller coaster set next to the beach or this is a different day. But once again, you can see Red Death has his hands up. He's enjoying that Red, he's enjoying that, uh, that Red Death roller coaster or roller coaster. You actually see the roller coaster is called the Cannonball. So um, that sounds like a lot of fun. And the last one is actually just Godspeed. So this is just a sole Godspeed leaked set photo. No Red Death involved. And it's just Godspeed um, dunking. It's, it's just him dunking. I um, think he's having fun there. And um, yeah. But yeah, guys, hopefully you enjoyed the video. Um, you know, I'm excited to see what they do in the next couple of episodes. We've got about two weeks until the Godspeed episode's out. Whether we get hints at Red Death in that episode or not, I have to wait and see. Maybe he's in later. But these castings are really cool. Um, you know, as I said, Ashton Kutcher was on Punk. I love Punk. I loved all the jokes and all the foolery and all that. And, um, yeah, but if you enjoyed the video, guys, it'd be awesome if you could drop a like on it and show you support. Let me know in the comment section down below your various thoughts and theories and stuff on what we went over in this video. And, of course, if you are new to the channel, uh, make sure to subscribe. Happy April Fool's Day, and I'll catch you guys later. Goodbye.